Two cases of canine influenza confirmed at the Animal Foundation and more than 100 dogs at the shelter are now symptomatic. Shauna Kalafi is live at the Animal Foundation with what they are doing to stop the spread of the virus and how you can help. And on top of these canine influenza cases, the Animal Foundation is also dealing with big intake numbers lately. They have taken in 900 animals in just the past couple weeks. So that's why they say there is a big need now to foster some of these dogs, get them out of the building as this canine influenza uh, issue spreads a little bit through the shelter. We know that two cases have been confirmed. More than 100 dogs are now showing symptoms. We were here this morning. We saw a long line of people waiting at the adoption center, ready to foster and do their part to help stop the spread of this virus. The Animal Foundation putting out an urgent call for foster families to get dogs out of the shelter and stop the spread of canine influenza in the building. So far, two dogs have tested positive for the highly contagious virus, and more than 100 are showing symptoms of respiratory disease, some awaiting test results. To other dogs and spreads really rapidly. Clinical signs are things like coughing, sneezing, nasal or eye discharge, uh, fever, lethargy, decreased appetite, and a lot of those signs can be indistinguishable from other bugs that cause respiratory disease. Now the Animal Foundation is asking anyone with room in their hearts and homes to consider fostering a dog, at least for a week, so that the shelter can properly isolate and care for the 500 dogs currently in their shelter. They say even the symptomatic dogs can be fostered. If they are showing symptoms, we do recommend that they are isolated from other dogs for three weeks from the time that we diagnosed them, um, or if they are not showing symptoms, to keep them away from other dogs for seven days just to make sure that they are not harboring um, or incubating that disease. After putting out the call for fosters late last week, the Animal Foundation already had more than 60 fosters come in over the weekend and dozens more on Monday, like this family who took home Oscar. The need was there and we have the space. I've got four kids at home, two rescue dogs. What's the third? If you'd like to foster a dog, the Animal Foundation is providing food, leashes and other supplies. And if you end up falling in love with your foster dog, all adoption fees will be waived so they can officially join your family. With my kids, we tend to adopt. <laughs> so this is the first time we're actually fostering. So we'll see. And if you'd like to foster and help the Animal uh, Foundation out, the Adoption Center will open again tomorrow from 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. And they say they are still in need of a lot of fosters. Reporting live, Shauna Kalafi, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.